Hiya, come in. Gail's just gone to the shops. Sarah, put the kettle on. Uh, isn't it a bit late for presents? Yeah, it's his official birthday. Yeah, I'm trying to rush it in before the end of the year. Oh, have you got me a present? I gave you a present the other day. Well, that was for Christmas. Yes, and I also gave you one for your birthday. No, that was for my real birthday. This is my official birthday. Oh, I can't get my head around all this. I'm sorry. Well, you'd have to if I were queen. Yes, well, you're not the queen, are you? Thank goodness. Well, if you haven't got me a present, you might as well go on. Uh, David! Listen to me, young man. This might be your official birthday, but it is also the anniversary of the day that your granddad died in that very chair. So, I'm going to say you sorry. Sorry. Yes. Well, it's obviously going to take more than two birthdays a year to help you grow into a decent, respectful human being. Oh, look at him. Yeah. He's happy. And I, for one, would like to see him and the rest of us look a bit more happy a bit more often. Yes, well, if you want to keep him happy, just give him a birthday every day of the year. No, I think two's more than enough, thanks very much. Can I say something? No, we can't have another birthday. You don't want another birthday, I just want to tell you something. What you want to tell us, sweetheart? Well, um, I just thought you both should know that I'm seeing Glenn again. Glenn? Yeah, Glenn. Does your mother know about this? Yeah, she does. Before you jump down my throat, the only reason I'm telling you is because I want you to take me seriously. Well, I figured if I tell you everything, then you can't worry about me, can you? No, no, that's a really good plan. But there's nothing you can do that won't worry us anymore. Why, because of Bethany? No, because we care about you. That's what parents do, you know. Well, is it all right, then, if he comes around tonight while I babysit? Mum's already said it's all right with her. Well, well it's all right with me, then. And let's be honest, he's a brave lad if he still wants to come around here after what happened last time. Mm -hmm. Maybe I was wrong. Obviously, there is uh, some maturity in this family. Oh, how come I have to invite them to my party? <laughs> because they're your friends, you've got the same school. Well, the girls, I didn't invite them. Girls are okay. And girls are okay. Yeah, well, some girls. Some girls. Any ideas, any suggestions, just let me know. Danny, just ask her. What, now? No, not now. Tonight. It feels right. Don't look boss on me. Hey, I know somebody who is. Come on. Uh, what's going on here, then? I thought I smelled burning. Do you want to tell me what you were doing? Nothing. What sort of nothing? Just burning stuff. Burning? Burning what? Plastic toys. Don't know what kind of toxic fumes are coming off them. They're using that. Have you been smoking? No. You're in deep trouble, you are, sunshine. What are you trying to do, burn the flaming house down? But I don't know what's wrong with you. We give you an extra birthday party and you go and do this. Well, what's the point, eh? Or are you just showing off to your big mates? Is that the big idea? You just have to spoil everything, don't you? And what were you doing upstairs anyway? Oh, well, I left. Because I thought I could trust you. Well, that's it. Party's over. You can't do that. Uh, don't you push your luck, you sunshine. Gentlemen, call her for Sarah. Oh, hi, Glenmere. How's it uh, going? Upstairs, uh, you. Go on, hey. up. And you, coats on. I'll take you home. Oh, it's mad house, mate. Yeah, it's the same at mine. Oh. Where's your coats? Have you had a good Christmas? Yeah, and you? Oh, yeah. Oh, there's someone who wants to meet. I mean, you've already met, but not official like. Come on. Well, this is Bethany, yeah, my daughter. This is Glenn. Would you like to hold her? Yeah, yeah, all right. Do you want to watch the other side? No, I'm not bothered. Me neither. What are you doing? Well, I thought you liked me. I do like you, but David's upstairs. Oh, he won't come down. You don't know David. Okay. 